There's some disturbing new information tonight on the meningitis outbreak. Inspectors searching the New England Compound Center found green, yellow, and red molds growing in the facility. And that follows last week's confirmation that black mold is what's making people sick from their shots. Tonight, Channel 9's Jeff Deal learned there's something else for victims to worry about. And Jeff, a lawyer representing some Marion County victims, told you this pharmacy could file for bankruptcy long before any lawsuits are addressed. He says that it is a very real possibility and something that his law firm is gearing up for. All of his clients are from here in Marion County, and some of them believe that they got sick after getting a shot at this pain management clinic. 82-year-old Doris Lachance is battling health problems she never expected. Her husband Earl says the problem seemed to come out of nowhere. We went out for dinner, and she was just different. I mean, I didn't even know who I was with. Doris had suffered back pain for years, and the doctor recommended she try Marion Pain Management Center. Earl says she was given two injections weeks apart, injections of the steroid the CDC says was tainted with fungal meningitis. We knew nothing about Meningitis, we had that was the furthest thing from our mind. While the CDC lists this clinic as one of the clinics connected to the multi state meningitis outbreak, Doris is still waiting for test results to determine if she has it. But with widespread reports of New England Compounding Center, the company behind the outbreak, considering filing for bankruptcy, her attorney is bracing for a battle. Hiring local bankruptcy counsel in the venue in which we think. The bankruptcy would be filed. Melvin Wright says even if NECC files for bankruptcy, there are still assets to go after for victims. He has 20 clients, all from Ocala, looking to file suit. And these people have suffered. My wife and everybody else said people have died. And the state health department says there have been 22 cases of meningitis connected to the to the tainted steroids. 15 of them are from here in Marion County, including. Three deaths. Reporting live in Marion County, Jeff Deal, Channel 9 Eyewitness News. George Zimmerman was back in court today as his lawyer.